Today, I will be ranking every Fortnite crew skin that we have gotten in the game. You can get these skins with the Fortnite monthly subscription. So let's see where I rank these skins. Starting with Galaxia, I think Galaxia was a great skin uh, to start off this monthly crew subscription. I'm going to be putting her in A. She has the Galaxy vibe that a lot of people like, including myself, but she's also colorful and vibrant. Green Arrow. Green Arrow is going in F. Don't get me wrong, I love Green Arrow, especially in the comics, but this skin just wasn't it for me. V. She is part of the Drift family. She will be going in S. I actually really enjoyed this skin. I like that she has a blue version as well. And I think she fits well with that Drift family. Lambro. Lambro is going in D. Usually I like the Llama skins, but this just wasn't for me. Up next is Allie, and she's actually part of the Lynx family. I think she's like a cousin or something like that. This skin was all right. There's some things I like about it, like the suit, but I don't really care for the hair. So she's going to be going in B. Demoise is a skin that I just don't think is very creative and I don't like that much. So he's going to be going in D. Mecha Cuddle Master, part of the Cuddle team, going to be going in C. I like the futuristic robotic type suit, but compared to these other skins, I just don't think... The skin is a B, A, or S tier. Loki. Loki is for sure going in S. They were spot on with this skin. Summer Sky is going in C. The skin is all right. It's just not for me. Burning Wolf. Burning Wolf is actually going in A. I think this is a really cool skin, especially when you see it in game. Chaos Origins. He's going in B. He's not as good as the original Chaos skin, in my opinion. Sierra. Sierra is going in S. She's an example of a simple skin being really good and looking really clean in game. Plus, she's tatted, so that's bonus for me. Q assassin is going in a really cool concept and overall just looks really cool in game snow stealth sloan she's going to be going in b i think this is a good version of sloan but i think we've had better ones aftermath is going in c honestly the only reason he's not going to be in d is because i think the mask is really cool to be honest tracy trouble i think she's going in c as well just a very basic skin in my opinion. And I don't think I've used the skin since I received it. Sayara is actually going to be joining her in C. I like the outfit and the hood is pretty cool and the mask, but overall I just think it's kind of boring. Southpaw is going in D. I don't really like the skin, but it has a little creativity to it. So that's why it's not an F. Mecha Strike Commander is going in F though. I just don't really like the big bulky robotic skin. And I feel like we have a handful of those already in Fortnite that are a lot better. Phaedra. Phaedra is going in A. I really like her outfit. I would love to see my girl in this outfit, to be honest. She'd have me barking. I really like the witch vibe of this skin. Overall, going in A. I really like it. It's a clean, simple skin. Wolverine Zero going in F. I just don't like this look for Wolverine. It's not really the Logan look, and it's not really the classic Wolverine look. So with that, it's going in F. Loveless. She is going in A. I really like the skin. She is the female version of the wild card skins and i really like those as well when they first released so overall just a clean skin red claw is going in d i just don't like the skin and joining red claw is going to be the inquisitor i don't really like that skin either i think i would like the inquisitor skin more if it didn't have the weird emoji mask on the head Joni the red i like her newer version more the high stakes version the red suit with the hat but i do enjoy this one she's gonna be going in b guildheart i don't really know what's going on with the skin i don't really like it so he's gonna be going in d sylvie is gonna be going in c she kind of she gives that disney vibe a little bit but overall just not a great skin to me and then joining her is gonna be rift knight kieran also a skin that gives me disney vibes but just not really for me now triarch nox he's going in s he looks tough i really like the look of the skin he gives me villain vibes like he looks like he can come and mess up the fortnite island dahlia i like her outfit and this the skin is pretty cool so she's gonna be going in b sticks is all right as well i kind of like his creepy look so i'm gonna be putting him in c with brizabelle she's gonna be going in d i think there's been better isabel type skins in the game and i just don't think she's better than some of the skins i have Above her. Princess Lexa is going to be going in A. I think she's a really good skin. I really like her outfit. I really like the eyes. But her brother, on the other hand, Prince Orin, he's going to be going in C. He's just kind of boring. I feel like he's almost just there. <laughs> to be honest. Astria is going in B. I think she's a very creative skin and I always like the galaxy look, especially in Fortnite. Shimmer Dusk. Now this is actually one of my favorites. She might actually be my favorite and I really like all of her legacy styles when it comes to these Fortnite crew skins. So she's going to be going in S for me. Volpez, I'm going to be putting him in D. I don't think I've worn him once to be honest. Dracon Steel Hybrid is going to be going in B. I think this skin looks tough. I really like it, the pickaxes and the back bling that come with them too. And again, he has legacy styles, which kind of helps him out in this tier list. Skull Scout. This is another one. 
that's going in S. She's a mix of the Skull Ranger and the Recon Scout skins kind of combined, and I really like that idea. I love when they mix skins like that. Like, for example, Renegade Lynx. I really like her legacy styles. Overall, I think she's a great skin. Silas is another one. He looks really cool. I think he's going in A. I like the detail of the snake wrapped around him. He looks really clean in game. Overall, I think is a really good skin. And Lana Lane, the most recent crew skin, I think she's going in B. If it wasn't for that bucket hat with like the strap, I think she would be in an A because I really like her outfit, to be honest, and I like the llama look, but the bucket hat with the strap just kind of ruins it for me. But this is my Fortnite crew skin tier list. Let me know some of your favorite crew skins in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like and subscribe. Use code TUNESPIDER in the Fortnite item shop, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Peace!